primates, which include monkeys and apes, are the closest genetically to human beings. That's why people teach them to do all sorts of stuff to varying degrees of success. These ten on our list are the valedictorians of the primate kingdom, so to speak. Especially number one who is probably the smartest ape in the world, so stay tuned for that one. Here are ten genius monkeys caught on camera. With all that said and done, let's begin, shall we? Number 10. Nemo the Orangutan Nemo, an orangutan from the Nakan Ratakasima Zoo in Thailand, has been captured on camera designing a hammock. And of course, the video became viral very quickly. She clambered up in her cage and fastened a piece of fabric together, forming the perfect spot for a nap. She can be seen tying knots and even testing her design. At one point when we thought she was done, she decided that her design was a bit off, so she unfastened one of the knots that she did to lower one side of the hammock. Only when she was satisfied did she then proceed to take her afternoon nap. We know that some apes are intelligent. Who would have thought that some of them could be interior decorators as well? Number 9. Sultan Much of the scientific knowledge concerning insight arrives from work on animal behavior that was conducted by 20th century German Gestalt psychologist Wolfgang Kohler. The undisputed star of his study is Sultan, a chimpanzee who was the brightest of the early chimpanzees used for psychological research. He's particularly recognized for his insight in solving numerous problems, including stacking or manipulating boxes to reach a reward and use of two sticks as a unit to rake food to a reachable distance. In one notable experiment, Kohler placed a banana outside of Sultan's cage and gave the animal two sticks, each too short for pulling in the food, but jointable to make a single stick of sufficient length. Sultan tried unsuccessfully to use each stick, and he even used one stick to push the other along to touch the banana. Later, apparently after having given up, Sultan accidentally joined the sticks, observed the result, and then immediately ran with a longer tool to retrieve the banana. When the experiment was repeated, Sultan joined the two sticks and solved the problem in no time at all. Number 8. The Thirsty Capuchin This tiny capuchin monkey is amazing. Capuchin monkeys are known to be very smart and trainable, but only in Japan, a place with the highest density of vending machines in the world at about one machine for 23 people. Too bad we couldn't get the name of this amazing little guy. He deserves to be famous worldwide. Number 7. Brent. Brent is a 37-year-old chimpanzee who lives at Chimp Haven, a sanctuary in Keithville, LA. According to popular opinion, he's also the greatest chimpanzee artist America has to offer. He was a former lab chimp and his flair for the arts was only discovered after he was transferred to Chimp Haven. Many other chimps can paint, and you'll find that out later on in this video. But one thing sets Brent apart. He doesn't use pens or brushes, he doesn't even use his hands. Instead he uses his tongue to create his masterpieces, giving them a unique aesthetic that only belongs to him. His art was even good enough to win an art competition. Brent's painting won first place in the Humane Society of the United States Chimpanzee Art Contest, garnering the most public votes during the online voting period. Six chimpanzee sanctuaries submitted entries, but Brent's work beat them all, winning $10,000 for his sanctuary. Number 6. The Monkey Mafia When humans first developed intelligence, we can safely say that our ancestors used that advantage over other animals to survive. Hence, we are the dominant species on this planet. For now, at least. Our primate relatives are quickly catching up, though, as scores of them have been showing signs of increased intelligence. And how do they take advantage of this intelligence, you might ask? Well, to take advantage of us, of course. Long-tailed macaques living near an Indonesian temple have figured out how to run a ransom racket on visiting tourists. The monkeys grab valuables such as glasses, hats, cameras, or in one case, a wad of cash from the ticket booth, then wait for the temple staff to offer them food before dropping their ill-gotten gains and dashing off with a tasty prize. It seems that only the monkeys that are living close to the vicinity exhibit this behavior, as other macaque populations never behave like this. Studies also show that these monkeys learn how to do this behavior by teaching it to other monkeys, as a group of monkeys slowly learn how to steal things for ransom as soon as they join the temple group. Number 5. Congo Congo is arguably the most famous of all primate painters. During his lifetime, he made 400 drawings and paintings, and just recently he was the first primate to have a solo exhibit of his works. His style has been described as lyrical abstract impressionism. He learned to draw near the age of two, beginning when zoologist Desmond Morris offered Congo a pencil. 
According to Morris, Congo took a pencil like a duck takes to water, and soon the chimp was creating magnificent works of art. And if you think that all of his artworks are just random doodles, you better think again. Congo will throw a tantrum if you take away from him a painting that he's not finished yet. He will also outright refuse to work on a piece that he has deemed finished. Media reaction to Congo's painting abilities were mixed, although relatively positive and accepted with interest. Spanish painter Pablo Picasso was reportedly a fan of his paintings and hung one of the ape's pictures on his studio wall after receiving it as a gift. Number 4. Washu. Washu the chimpanzee holds the distinction of being the first non-human to learn to communicate using American Sign Language. She was born in West Africa in 1965 and was captured for use by the U.S. Air Force for research for the U.S. Space Program. She was named after Washu County, Nevada, where she was raised and taught to use ASL. Washu started learning ASL in 1967 under the tutelage of Alan and Beatrix Gardner. At the time, previous attempts to teach chimpanzees to imitate vocal languages, namely the Gua and Vicky projects, had failed. The gardeners raised Washu as one would raise a child. She frequently wore clothes and sat with them at the dinner table. Washu had her own 8 foot by 24 foot trailer complete with living and cooking areas. The trailer had a couch, drawers, a refrigerator, and a bed with sheets and blankets. She had access to clothing, combs, toys, books, and a toothbrush, much like a human child and she also underwent a regular routine with chores, outdoor play, and rides in the family car. During her lifetime, Washu learned approximately 350 words of sign language, but that's not all that she learned. Through her, we found out that apes have a sense of empathy towards others. In one story, one of Washu's caretakers was pregnant and missed work for many weeks after she miscarried. Washu looked directly into her eyes and signed the words for cry while gently stroking her cheek with her finger. Number three. Ayumu. Ayumu is one of 14 chimpanzees spanning three generations living at the Primate Research Institute of Kyoto University, Japan. It's here that Institute Director Professor Matsuzawa started a high-tech study of chimp intelligence over 30 years ago. He describes the chimps as his research partners, but of all the apes here, it's Ayumu that's proved to be the real genius. Just watch the video and watch him in action. The professor describes him as naughty but harder working than other juvenile chimps. Ayumu has excelled at the university and is capable of an incredible mental feat. In just 60 milliseconds, less than the blink of an eye, he can remember the position of nine numbers randomly displayed on a computer screen, something that even the best human minds can find impossible. Now it's time for the day's best pick. In today's pick, we're going to meet quite possibly the most intelligent gorilla in the world. Find out just who that is next with number two, Coco. Hanabiko, more famously known as Coco, was a female western lowland gorilla known for having learned many hand signs from a modified version of American Sign Language. Coco was born at the San Francisco Zoo and lived most of her life in Woodside, California at the Gorilla Foundation's preserve in the Santa Cruz Mountains. Her instructor and caregiver, Francine Patterson, reported that Coco had an active vocabulary of more than 1,000 signs of what Patterson calls Gorilla Sign Language, or GSL. This puts Coco's vocabulary at the same level as a three-year-old human. National Geographic magazine featured Coco on its cover twice, first in October of 1978 with a photograph that she took of herself in a mirror, and she also appeared a second time on the cover in January of 1985 in a story about Coco and her pet kitten. Yeah, she had a pet kitten, which probably makes her the first animal to have a pet. Well, maybe domesticated animal to have a pet. Tragically though, she passed away in 2018, but not before giving the world a final message. Look for it in YouTube, it's pretty touching. Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Number 1. Kanzi. Kanzi is probably the most intelligent chimpanzee on the planet. This guy can have conversations with humans using signs and symbols, of course, make a campfire, and even make simple tools out of stone. Even more amazing is that he wasn't taught to do most of those things. He learned them initially by observation. When Kanzi was an infant, American psychologist Sue Savage Rumba tried to teach his mother, Matata, to communicate using a keyboard labeled with geometric symbols. Matata never really got the hang of it. 
The Kanzi, who usually played in the background, seemingly oblivious, during his mother's teaching sessions, picked up the language. Roomba claims that in addition to the symbols Kanzi uses, he knows the meaning of up to 3,000 spoken English words. In 2005, Kanzi and his sister, mother, nephew, and four other bonobos moved into a $10 million, 18-room house and laboratory complex at the Great Ape Trust, North America's largest Great Ape sanctuary, five miles from downtown Des Moines. The bonobo compound boasts a 13,000-square-foot lab, drinking fountains, outdoor playgrounds, rooms linked by hydraulic doors that the animals operate themselves by pushing buttons, and a kitchen where they can use a microwave oven and get snacks from a vending machine by pressing the symbols for desired foods. Which intelligent primate impressed you the most? Let us know in the comment section down below. Want to watch more videos about amazing animals? Click on any of the videos you see on your screen. As always, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later, everybody.